Most scientific calculators come with a D or G button. That's how it looks like on this one. There. And what it does is it changes some letters on the display. Say that one says red. That one says just DEG. And this one says GRED. And when it's important that you have your correct mode for your calculations, because I entered sine 45 there, and sine 45 there, and you can see these are different decimal numbers because the calculator is in different modes. That's degrees, that's radians, and this one is gradients there. Okay, and you can see these are totally different decimal numbers. So, when you want to use your sine, cosine, and tangent functions, or their second functions uh, of them, it's super important that your calculator be in the right mode. This DEG stands for degrees, it, and the calculator works in degrees, minutes, and seconds. And in this mode, the calculator works in radians, where Whereas here, 360 degrees make a circle. Here, uh, 6.28 radians make a full circle. And here, 400 gradients make a full circle. That's why you're seeing three different decimal numbers. Okay, so it's important that you know how to set your calculator to the right mode. And in most calculators, here, take a look at this uh, relatively simple one. It's... Uh, it's a toggle button, so when, once you press it, then uh, let me just get a good shot on uh, on the display there. So once you press the button, you can see that the degrees, radians, and gradients toggle. Okay, so I'm just pressing this button. Super simple. Same on this one. And there, if I press the DRG button, there it's a better contrast shot. There you can see I'm just toggling with the modes. Same on this Texas instrument. It just it just toggles. Okay, very simple. Same on this one. Alright, you have your DRG button. But uh, but on this one it doesn't work that simply. You have to go into setup and then degrees, radians and gradients are selected by pressing the button zero. And then you can choose between degrees, radians and gradients by entering zero, one or two. I want to be in degrees on this one, so and I don't want to change that. Okay, so it's it's important that uh, that you calculate in the right mode. Watch out what's on display, okay, and uh, and change it uh, according to your calculation needs.